Good morning. Welcome to Lucky Dog Productions. Today we're going to be making a cooking video. We're going to be doing aluminum foil packet meal. Um, here's the aluminum foil. These are the ingredients we're using. We're going to have potatoes, onions, and Cajun and Dewey sausage. So follow along. Okay, so today we're going to be making foil packet dinner. Uh, we're going to use potatoes, onions, Cajun style andouille smoked sausage. Uh, we're gonna put some uh, sour sauerkraut in here, so we'll see how that works out. Garlic, black pepper, some complete seasoning, uh, some oregano, cayenne pepper, uh, some Italian seasoning, chopped chives. Oh, that's more Italian seasoning. We got that twice, so. We'll take one of them out. But anyway, we're going to do it up and put it in the foil packet. Okay, we're gonna start with, we've already chopped up our, we have red potatoes. We've already chopped them up into large dice pieces. So we're gonna start by seasoning our potatoes. I'm gonna use a little olive oil, drizzle them a little bit with olive oil. And then we're gonna add some spices in there. So a little chopped chives. hard to come out with the uh, shaker. Uh, a little Italian seasoning. Well, I, glad I looked. There's no cover on that one. A little cayenne pepper. <laughs> Let's see, I'll use the flip top for that. We don't want them, we want them flavorful, but not too spicy. A little oregano. Smells good already. And now we're gonna mix it up. Okay, we've got our potatoes all mixed up here. Look, don't they look nicely seasoned? So I'm gonna sit them off to the side and we're going to start assembling. Uh, like I said before, we're going to use Cajun and Dewey sausage. And it's uh, smoked sausage, so that'll be a little spicy. Uh, we're gonna put that on there and we're gonna add some sauerkraut. And we're going to add some garlic, of course, and top it with a little complete seasoning. So let's get started building these foil packets here. All right, we'll start with the potatoes. Try and get them right in the middle here. Of course we won't, but. I think these were just five small potatoes. See, left over from last month, so we wanted to get them used up. Whoop, runaway potato. There, I think that looks good. Set that off to the side. Next, we're gonna add some onions. And we just dice these up too, because it doesn't take long for onions to cook. The potatoes are what's gonna take longer. Oh, those smell so good. All right. Now we're going to add our andouille sausage. My foil packets might not be big enough. <laughs> so, there we go. They're running around. Look at them running around over there. Let's see, what else do we have? Oh, garlic. Let's put our garlic in here. I lost my spoon. There. There's some good looking garlic in there. And finally, we're gonna put our butter on next. Let's just put a few pats of butter in here on each one, because you know butter adds flavor. I think three per patty should be good. One was a little small, so maybe I'll do four. There's four on that one. One more on this one. All right, now we're gonna do the sauerkraut. Can't get that open. Maybe we'll do the sauerkraut. <laughs> I 
little bit of these seasonings on the top. It's kind of spicy, a little salty, so that we don't want too much. That should be good. Okay, now we're going to add some of the sauerkraut. I don't know if I'm gonna add the whole thing or not, but uh, we'll just see, because putting sauerkraut on top of this is a bit of an experiment. It smells really good, but sausage and sauerkraut go well together, so. How's that look there? We'll do, we'll stop with there. All right, now we're going to put our foil packet lid on and hope we can make this all fit inside. <laughs> I think these are a lot bigger than I thought they were gonna be. I'm just going to turn the ends up here and make a little, like a little boat. We don't want them fall them out, falling out on top of the grill. The ends are gonna be no problem. We'll just get these sides tucked in really well. So there's one. Set it off to the side. Bring this one up. Oh, this looks good. Hope it turns out good. Kind of using these like a cover. There we go. We're getting that one all nicely tucked in. We watched another channel recently do a uh, foil packet. I think it was Catherine's, Catherine's plate. So shout out to Catherine's plates there for her foil packet. She has a good cooking channel. We enjoy watching her. There we are. There's our foil packets. Next, we're gonna put them on the grill. All right, Sue asked me if I would take over with the grilling part, because you know what guys don't do the grilling, you know? So we're gonna go ahead and light up the grill here. It's, uh, we don't want this uh, too warm. So I'm gonna kind of put this on a low setting. And basically that's all is too. I'm gonna get these down pretty low. I don't wanna cook them too fast or too hot so that everything doesn't burn in it. So we're gonna come in here. I'm figuring, I'm gonna keep checking on them, but I'm figuring it's gonna take approximately, uh, I'm gonna guess 20 to 30 minutes, maybe longer, but we'll find out here. So we've got our packets on the grill, getting ready to grill them out. So I'm getting hungry, these should be great. I can hear them bubbling away. What I'm gonna do is just kind of open this up a little bit and see how things are looking. Oh yeah, potatoes are done. That's the main thing, once the potato's done, we're all set. We're gonna go ahead and shut down the, the grill and uh, put these foil packets over here on our little tray to take them in. All right, hey, they took about 30 minutes. They didn't take really too long, but- Smells let's, really good. Let's open them up. Let me get a couple plates ready here. Mm -hmm. Got a couple forks. I think I'm gonna do here is just take a fork here and just kind of open them up. Oh, well, they look good, oh. they smell good. I'm gonna open them both up here. We'll give you guys a little look at it. Oh, they're hot, so. Hockey -dockey. So they steam them. What happens is you put it in there and they steam them out. I gotta show this to you guys. Look at this here. Doesn't that look delicious? We're gonna plate these up here and uh, take a taste try. So, Sue, you did a good job. Hey, thank you. We'll, we'll know what they taste like here in a minute. We're gonna so. taste it right here, right? So right, she's gonna like do yeah, a little taste see. right there. A little taste test here. All right, go for it. Get right in there. Go on right in there, how you think? Mm. Okay, hey, we're gonna play them up here. All right, Sue, so where did you see? Did you see this somewhere else you said that the... Uh... Uh, Catherine's Plates, okay. uh, another YouTube channel. Uh, she has a really good chance to check her out. She did a foil packet dinner not too long ago. All right, let's So that see. gave me an idea for to make these with ours. Let's get like, in here and take a bite once. Oh, that was pretty good. And the sauerkraut. A little bit of sausage. And the sauerkraut is good too. With this sausage. is uh, that Bavarian sauerkraut. Mm-hmm, it was really good. That would you good. give that a thumbs up? I would, I'd give it. Thumbs up. Give it two thumbs up. Two, th two cool. thumbs up. All right. So, hey, thanks for following along with us making this uh, Andouille, Cajun Andouille sausage foil packet dinner. Um, hope you liked it. Uh, we do. We sure do. So if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. 
Uh, please hit the like, uh, subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. And ring the bell if you want to be notified of other videos that we do. If you do. got any comments, leave them in that yeah, section below. That's right, comments. We love comments. So uh, let us know what you think. And uh, we'll see you next time. And happy cooking. Happy eating. Happy eating. Get that grill Bye. out. If you'd like to support our channel, if you click in the section below, we're an Amazon affiliate. If you click on that link, that'll take you right to Amazon and we'll get a small percentage of everything you order and it absolutely costs you nothing. It's like giving us a tip. If you'd like to order t-shirts, we have a t-shirt uh, shop in Teespring. Click on that link and you can go in and get t-shirts, coffee check mugs, and there's also stickers there. If you'd like to order one of our stickers, you can go to the PayPal link and order a sticker just put your name address and how many stickers you like or if you'd like to just give us a tip you can also do that through the paypal link we thank you for your support